Rolling with resistance is an important skill that can help you deal with difficult situations. We're going to look at some scenarios that highlight the sort of resistance you may come across and the different methods you can use to handle it better. But to start with, let's look at an example where a conversation with a resistant parent goes wrong. I've, uh, I've got you a drink, babe, just like I promised. You can have it afterwards. Excuse me, I, I'd rather you didn't give that to Taylor. Fizzy drinks are full of sugar and they're really bad for her teeth. Yeah, well, it's just a little treat that I promised her that she could have if she was good and came here today. So that's why I'm going to give it to her. Well, I'm sure you know that's not the best thing for her. It's full of sugar. And that's probably the reason why Taylor's teeth are full of decay. You shouldn't be giving her that kind of stuff to drink. You should be giving her water, especially when it, it looks as if Taylor's not been cleaning her teeth properly. They really are in a very, very poor condition. They're full of holes. You what? Are you blaming me for that? You're saying her teeth are in bad condition because I don't look after them properly. We're probably going to have to take one or two teeth out. In the meantime, I need a clear idea of Taylor's overall diet and toothbrushing. Try to get to the bottom of why her teeth are in such a bad way. I'd like you to fill in a diary of Taylor's diet over three days, with one of those days over a weekend. Who are you? The teeth police checking up on me. I have told you, I don't give her any fizzy drinks or sugary snacks. It shouldn't be me that's having to fill in this diary. She spends most of her weekends with her dad's. It, He's the one that doesn't look at what she eats or drinks. Well, she's getting the holes from somewhere. Holes just don't appear for no reason. I need to have a clear picture of her diet and her toothbrushing. You are her mum. I think you are the one responsible for sorting this out. Uh, I am sorting it out. That's why I'm here, innit? Well, you know what? This has been an absolute waste of my time. You might be thinking that was a bit extreme. Well, it probably was. But it was a good example of how not to deal with resistance. The dentist wasn't very empathetic at all, and this made the resistance worse. There may be many reasons why a parent resists the advice you give them, and we know how difficult it can be to change unhealthy behaviours. Sometimes people aren't quite ready to change, and it's important to support them to the next step. 